Hey everyone, welcome to this week's episode. So this week I'm going to talk about how to create consistency in your photography. Tip number one is your setup and your style. Because um, as you start off, you're still experimenting between here and there and what you sort of like and what you want your images to look like. But once you start to you know, photograph a lot of babies, you start to develop a certain type of setups you like to do and styles you like to you know, create with these newborns. Now with my business, a lot of clients come to me because they like the setups that I've been you know, um, having and putting together for these newborns and the sessions that I've been doing. And I've actually created a signature style that I like to do which includes a lot of bright colors a lot of you know particular setups that I use um, and my images I get told a lot by clients that they're nice and bright so that's become my signature style so once you start experimenting try if you ever feel comfortable and like doing something and you love these particular images that you've created then continue to do very similar things to that and then that will become your own signature style as well tip number two is the angles that you take now, I, you probably find a few photographers that you follow that you can identify their images because of the angles that they take. Yes, uh, apart from you know, the setups and the props that they use, but angles can identify who you are as a photographer and create that consistency in your image workflow. So you might like to take all wide top angles or side 45 degree angles like I do or you know really close up detailed macro shots as well. I know particular phot photographers by their images because all they like to do in their newborn images is take those cl really close detailed shots. So taking those particular um, you know, shots can actually create that consistency in your business and that way when clients come and book you, that's what they expect as well from you. Tip number three is the mood of your images. So the mood, the, 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 the feel of your images and how they look. I said this a little bit in tip number one, that my clients come to me because they like colorful, bright images. So this is what they say to me. And that's pretty much the mood of my overall imagery for my newborn sessions. And if clients look at that and they relate to that and they like that, this is one main reason why they book me in. And I get told this by every single client that comes in, um, and especially when we ask them in their questionnaire, is they come to me because of the bright colored images. So understanding what mood you want to create in your images. A lot of my friends who are photographers like the brown, dark toned colors. That's the mood of their images. So understanding that when creating an image is really important for consistency. So there you have it. That's three tips on how to create consistency in your images. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you have any tips of your own, please let me know in the comments below. And before you head off, if you haven't already, go download my new born session guide. It's absolutely free over at thephotographersociety.com. And go on over and follow me on Instagram if you haven't already. So I guess I will see you next week for another video. Until then, take care.